Hello everyone, welcome to exam prep to DSA 30 days challenge. We completed approximately 18 challenges already. 19th challenge, I am giving the answer now. I hope you are enjoying, right? If you have any doubts, in the comment section you can write. Let's see the challenge number 19, almost like challenge number 18 only, I am going to explain. Right? Now see this one. This problem also can be solved like DFT. Right, using the previous one means DFT algorithm can solve this problem. How it is, I'm going to explain. Right, so I'm going to explain everyone listen. So I took one graph. Remember, it is an undirected graph. We have to identify psychic. In the given undirected graph, how to find out psychic? That is the purpose of this problem. Using DFT, we can do it. How I'm going to do this? Right, what you do is take one digit array. Take one visited array. So let me take one visited array. How many people are there? 4 plus 4, 8, 9 vertices. Total 9 vertices. Let me explain now. 4, 4, and 9. 4 here, 4 here, 9. So let's see this one. A here, B here, C here, D here, E here, F, G, H, I. All people. Visited of every person is initially 0 not visited initially everyone is not visited now I, how i am going to do please listen properly please listen properly so i started algorithm from a see this one DF, dft algorithm i started from a dft algorithm i started from a listen carefully dft algorithm started from a so current vertex is a visited array it is a global array global array no problem and one more thing is, right, DFT algorithm I started from A and I have to say what the A previous. Let us assume that A previous, starting node previous is minus 1. Previous is initially minus 1. Right, previous is initially minus 1. Assume. Right, current vertex is A, is previous is minus 1. Right, observe properly, observe properly. Right, so P is as of now minus 1. Initially, P is from outside, it is a minus 1. Right now, see first step. See the first step? See the first step. Widgeted of A is equal to 1. Okay. Widgeted of A is equal to 1. And the previous is minus 1, that is absolutely fine. Previous is minus 1, that is absolutely fine. Next one, what you do is what the DFT algorithm will do is A adjacent find out, take one person. So C. So A adjacent is actually B also C also. A, actual, A adjacent is actually B also C also, but DFT will take one of the person. So it will take C, it will take C, do the same story. It will take C, DFT algorithm you will do. So it's one DFT algorithm. Current vertex is C and is previous, is previous is remember previous is, I think a previous one is, I think this one, A. It is in A. So every person record what are the previous. So current vertex is going to be C, previous is A. Right? Same story. What are the first step? C will be digited. Now same story. What is the answer? C adjacent to find out. C adjacent is going to be A also, D also, E also. Take one of the person. Take one of the person, but remember, remember, right? That person cannot be previous. So remember, C previous is A. So C adjacent is A also, D also, E also. But C adjacent is A, which is previous. Don't take. Don't take it. That is the only reason why I am passing previous. And every person having his own previous, right? They are not common. So A previous is minus 1 because starting. So now see this one. C previous is A. Right? Now see what the answer. So I am at C now, C adjacent is A, D, E, but A is previous, don't take. D and E, anyone you can take. So I am taking the E, I am taking the E. So DFT apply, DFT apply, right, by going E. So you came here. But previous, if you observe, if you see the E previous, C. Again DFT. So what is the answer? E visited. E visited. Alright, next one. After visiting E over, next one what you do is E adjacent people find out. 
which are not vegetated, which are not vegetated. See, E adjacent, which are not vegetated. E adjacent, which are not vegetated. So then what is the answer? E adjacent is going to be H also, F also. E adjacent is H also, F also. But you may say that C also, but you cannot take previous. You cannot take previous. So E adjacent is going to be F and H. So I will take H. So what is the answer now? So DFT I will apply, right? DFT I, I will apply on H and the previous one if you observe E. Previous one if you observe E. Same story going on. What is the answer? H will be visited. Within a few minutes you will get the clarity. H will be visited. Next. Next what is the answer? So lack of space I am adjusting here. It is a recursive program. Everywhere doing the same story. So what is the answer? H adjacent to find out. H adjacent to find out, right? Adjacent you cannot take, which is previous, right? Which is exactly previous. H adjacent E don't take. So remaining things I and F. So take the right DFT algorithm curve by taking I. I previous is H. So once again, call the DFT story. I is visited. I is visited. I think uh, I is visited. That is fine. Next one is going to be, next one is going to be I adjacent what? Which are not visited. I adjacent what? Which are not visited. I think all are over. That means, listen, that means this is completed. Pop out. So you will go to previous. Can you help you now? Previously H. H adjacent is what? I also, F also. I completed. I completed. Now F. Right now, yes. So that is the meaning of backtracking. So you came back because of no option. Now, now it will call the F. So lack of space, I'm going to F. DFT call on F. But F at F previous. What is F previous? So careful, everyone. F previous what? Previous is from where you came. F previous is going to be H. H you can. Now again, same. What is the answer? F is visited of F is 1. Now, now, visited of F is 1, okay. Who is the F adjacent? F adjacent is E, which is already visited. F adjacent is H, which is already visited. You know very well. The things which are already visited, you know need to visit. Right? Next one. I think F adjacent is G. So, I think G will be called. D F T G called. What is this previous? G previous is what? F. Right? Again, same. G visited. G visited. Right? Next one. After G visited, everyone, everyone observe now. So, I think you went here. Because of backtracking, you came back. You went here. You went here. You are currently status here. Now, I am at G now. G already visited. Can I help you? Who is the G adjacent which are not visited? I think D. I think it is so DFT D called D previous G. So D visited. D visited. Now who is the D adjacent which are not completed? I think B. I think B. So B called DFT of B called. What is the B previous? D. So same story. What is the answer? So B is visited. B is visited. Now you will see the interesting story. B is visited. Okay, fine. B is visited. It's okay, fine. Next one. Can I help you? Know, who is the B adjacent? Who is the B adjacent? I want answer from all of you. Who is the B adjacent? B adjacent is this one. B adjacent is A. B adjacent is A, which is not previous. I am at B now. B adjacent to what? D also, A also. Right? Both are adjacent. But interesting is B previous is D. But B previous is not A but visited. This means cycle. Means what is the meaning? You have to come in some other path. You came to the old one. Old one by same. It. See, you went like this, you came. It is not a cycle. You came to the old one by different path. Means B previous is not A. But is the is the old one, but it is not a previous one. This indication that here cycle is happening. Here cycle is happening. So cycle happened here. What I mean to say is, if you visit the old person, 
it doesn't mean that cycle old person which is not previous that is a cycle that is the reason everywhere i am managing previous everywhere i am managing previous what is my previous so i am going to the old one which is not previous then it is a cycle so i written the code also roughly i written the code also you can see this if you want if you want you can you can see right one more example also here one more example also here see this one you can see one more example also here A here, B here, C here, D here, E here, F here. Remember, old one, if you visit, it is not a cycle. Old one, which is not previous, then it is a cycle. Then it is a cycle. So, I will explain here. I am at here. I am at here. Widgeted. Widgeted of A is 1. But remember, remember, widgeted of A is 1. A previous is minus 1. A previous is minus 1. Adjacent people take one person and go there. I am at here. So, B also visited. But B previous remember. B previous remember A. Right? B previous remember A. In the similar way. B, B people adjacent which are not visited. So, I will go here. Is not visited, I went there. So, C also visited. But C previous is B. Careful. These are previous. These are previous. Every person having previous. Right? First person previous is minus 1. Next one. I am at C now. So, C adjacent which are not visited. This person I will go. Because visited of this person is not 1 as of now. Is not visited so I came. So, now visited of D. Visited of D is equal to 1. Now only visited. What is the D previous? C. Right? I came to here. Again E also not visited. Widget of E is equal to 1. What is the E previous? E previous D. Right? Fine. Now, I think E, e adjacent people, I think this person is not widgeted. So, F widgeted is 1. But F previous is E. Now, now observe. Now observe everyone. Now observe everyone. Now observe everyone. I am at F now. Who is the F adjacent? Who is the F adjacent? I want answer from you. F adjacent is B, which is already visited because F is already one. See, sorry, F adjacent is B, which is already visited. Okay, old person. F adjacent is B, which is already visited. But interesting thing is, F previous is not B. Means what the name? You came in some other path. But one more interesting thing is, F adjacent is E, which is already visited, but it is a previous. Means no cycle. F adjacent is B, which is already visited, but not previous. But not previous. That means this is leads to cycle, which is also called baggage. Normally it is called baggage. This terminology, instead of saying big story, they just given simple name baggage. So while doing a DFT algorithm, if you find out baggage, so cycle exists. Cycle exists. You have to do. You have to compare the previous person. Other than this, nothing there. Compare the previous person. I think I written the code also. See the code, rough code I give. I, I try to give some pseudo code, not some programming language code, some pseudo code. Right? Let's see this one. See this one? So, so here, I call the cyclic function. Cyclic or cycle, whatever it is. I call the cyclic function. If it is true, cycle is there. Otherwise, no cycle. So, what this function will do? Let's see here. It is actually cyclic. So, what this function will do is all vertices you will keep visited as initially zero. Now, you will take one of the vertex, right? In all the vertices, one of the vertex you will take, and you will start doing visited of that vertex is false or not? You will check. If not visited, then only visited. Visited of that vertex is false? Yes. Then call. Then call. DFS algorithm, right? See this one. I call DFS algorithm, some name I given. I call DFS algorithm. I pass with that vertex. Visited array also I am passing. And parent as of now, minus 1. I am calling this function. DFT algorithm I am calling. Right? That vertex I am passing. Which vertex? If A is A, I, I is I. So maybe A. 
a pass in and a initial pre right a a vortex previous is minus one i am passing it is a recursive program right it will go here it will go here let's see what 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 it will get a came visited array is came it's okay parent is minus one as soon as you came inside the first one visited of a is true visited of a is true afterwards afterwards after it became true now what you will do see this one now for the for the a for the a who is adjacent to find out a adjacent all find out let us assume that b now check visited of b is equal to false or not if not visited then only i will visit yes false means not visited then call recursion but remember right remember here so parent place you are passing parent place you are passing v what is a v a you are passing a previous parent is minus 1 now parent is a next parent b like that it is keep on updating it's keep on updating some point of time what happened is which did of i is equal to false if false you will call recursion it is fail it is fail means visited this is fail means visited so if it is visited if it is visited come here then check parent right parent not equal to i parent is not parent is not i check it is already visited right parent is the right parent is the previous one parent is the previous one for the i right see so i think what is the current person i current person is i parent not equal to i if it is equal not equal to i if it is equal false right see so parent not equal to i then return true whenever whenever you saw the previous person parent is not equal Pre parent is not equal to previous one right see so i think what is the parent just i want to ask you one thing to you what is the what is the parent let us assume that pay, right let us assume that let us assume that parent is a i is b see i is b i is b parent is a so a is not equal to b just check both they both are not same right if they both are not same true cycle happened if they both are same if they both are same so i think cycle not be something like that same story whatever i explained same thing happened here check properly check properly right whatever condition i verified so go to the previous one and verify here also see i am at here b i am at f here what is f previous f previous is p f previous is p so what i am doing is right f parent right f parent is e f parent is e e not equal to this i that's what you want to say that that's what you want to say that so cycle exist so like this same whatever i explained just execute properly you will get the clarity right fine i hope everyone is fine it is exactly dft it is exactly dft so time complexity v plus e if it is a list if it is a list of time complexity is v plus e if it is a matrix v sorry matrix v square adjacency matrix v square i hope you got it